Hey guys, Mystery Wheel Gunner back here with you again. Just doing a little little video on uh, grip compatibility. Just going to test out some of the claims made by Colt as far as which grips can fit the 2021 Colt Anaconda and the 2020 Colt Python. I am not selling any grips here. Uh, just, just showing you grip compatibility. Alrighty, so I've got a Colt Anaconda here. The Anacondas come with the, I believe it's a Hogue Mono Grip. These come with the, uh, I took it off already just to save some time. These come with the familiar U-mount uh, thing. Some people call this the stirrup. Anyway, already took that off. It also has a retaining pin that comes with it. Uh, don't, don't lose these. Anyway, this grip was really on there tight. Taking off the, the screw, that was like one-eighth of the battle. <laughs> Trying to pull this off was a, was a nightmare. Anyway, took the grips off of a 2020 Python. Got those grips right here. And of course, now I fumble when the camera is on. Come on now. Okay, finally got them apart. They weren't even screwed together. I don't know why they decided to get all sticky all of a sudden. Anyway, remember that little retaining pin? Yeah, you're going to need that. Yeah, I know I'm looking like a fumble fingers here, but <laughs> got the I got the camera in the way to mind and anyways. So you've got multiple little pins here, locator pins. So you've got this one here that came from the Anaconda. And then you've got two pins that come with the 2020 Python grip. All right. All those pins have to line up. And once they do, hey, they do fit nice and snug. I have not tightened it down yet with the uh, with the tightening screw, but nonetheless, <laughs> it already feels nice. Feels uh, secure, I should say. You know, there's no there's no slop in there. So obviously, when I tighten it down, it's going to be even more secure. Looks pretty nice. Um, <laughs> because of the size of the big Conda, uh, it looks, these grips look small in proportion. <laughs> they look a little out of place. because uh, These are not small grips, but because they're on the Anaconda now, they, they, look, they do look a little small. But, but they will fit. So this is confirmed. 2020 Python grip will indeed fit nice and snug on a 2021 Anaconda. Okay, time to test out compatibility between the 2020 Python and the old school Python grips. So I have some grips here made for the old school Python. These are Kulina grips. I'm not selling you these grips. I don't work uh, for that company. I'm just passing along the manufacturer's name as you know part of information here. So these were indeed made for the old school Python. Will these fit on the 2020 Python? You can see there's a locator pin here. Only one locator pin with the Kulina grips. And of, and of course, I'm fumbling now that the camera is on there we go it isn't this hard people it's just <laughs> there's a delay between what i see 
on the camera and what's going on here. All right, so I have not cinched it down, but just from the fitment and that locator pin, just from those things alone, it's snug. Okay, and it'll, it'll just get even it'll just get even more snug when I tighten it down. So uh, confirmed. Old school grips made for the old school Python fit nice and snug on a 2020 Python. All right, time for the final test. Will the old school Python grips fit on the 2021 Anaconda? Okay, they fit on there, but there is a little bit of play. See that? Uh, everything's fitted, and the locator pin is in the right place. But there is a little bit of play there. But it's not cinched down, so uh, let me... Let me tighten down the retaining screw. Okay, with the retaining screw snug down, of course, the grip doesn't move anymore. It took up, you know, there, there, there's no more of that back and forth, a little bit of slop. But, uh, I don't know, will it move under recoil? That's the big question. I'll have to, I'll have to take this out to the range uh, to find to find that out. But there you go. Uh, 2020 Python, 2021 Colt Anaconda. Yeah, they seem to have good uh, compatibility. 20, 2020 Python and old school Python. Again, seems to be good grip compatibility. Old school Python, 2021 Anaconda. As you saw, ah. Uh, not as fit as I would have liked them uh, to be. You saw the little bit of uh, back and forth slop in there. But of course, with the grips tightened down, the slop goes away. But my worry is that, you know, with just lateral pressure, keeping the grips from sliding around, these might move under, under hard recoil. Uh, not that I'm, you know... Not that I'm blaming the grip manufacturer here, okay. These are good quality grips, but you have to you keep in mind uh, these are these are advertised as for the old school Python. So there's no, you know, I'm not trying to imply any deception, okay. These are advertised. These Kalina grips as are, are advertised as being compatible with the old school Python. And as we saw, they are compatible with the new school Python as well. It's just that I guess there's enough of a variance between uh, the old school Python and the new 2021 Anaconda that uh, grip, grips, grips specifically made for the old school Python. Yeah, they might have a little bit of that uh, little slop in there. But all right, hopefully this was... Uh, informative or at the very least maybe a little bit entertaining but all right thanks for watching catch you all next time now some of these grips really do fit nice and tight which is what you want but sometimes taking them off can then be a little bit of a challenge do not use a screwdriver to try and pry these apart that'll just mar up your grips what you're going to want to do is to get some type of paper mallet I happened to get this. Uh, I forgot what I ordered, but I ordered so I ordered something big in the mail. I think it was a chair, you know, like a gaming chair or something. Anyway, this was in the packaging to help protect the uh, the gaming chair during shipping. Anyway, it's it's just cardboard, okay? 
it's wound up tight, so it's rigid. But cardboard versus wood, guess what? This is softer than wood. So all you gotta do, get something like this and just give a little tap. See that? And the grips start to start to come apart. Again, you don't want to bash it like this. You want to give a little glancing blow, just like that. All right, and the grips will then start to come apart. And then you can just peel them apart with your hand. Again, do not do not use a screwdriver. <laughs> okay, that'll just mar them up.